One of my favorite things to grow in the summer is herbs. There's just so many textures and scents. Um, they're delicious. And this season we've been carrying a lot of the Footprints line. So why don't you tell us a little bit about that? Yes, the idea of the Footprints is, is like the name says, it leaves very little footprint on the environment, Great. which is what a lot of people are interested in. Mm -hmm. they're, they're grown naturally. They don't have pesticides so that you, know, you can use them visually. And the fact that they're grown in these biodegradable rice pots. Yeah. So you can actually plant the whole pot in the ground and not have a plastic pot that you're disposing of. Right. Yeah. And, and another great thing for this line is that there's a website on each and every one of these pots that you can visit that has different recipes that you can use this. Or... Right, and uh, inside the store we have uh, some printed out recipes for people too. Great, great. Okay. Um, what's, what's also important about some of these herbs is if they have a spicy or a pungent fragrance, it makes them deer resistant. Exactly. Uh, deer is such an important thing. You have the thyme, which is ornamental, uh, it attracts pollinators, it can be used for food, and uh, deer resistant, it's just got all that stuff going for you. And it's a perennial, so it'll come back season after season. And I have lemon balm, which can be used for tea, or you can actually rub it on you as an insect repellent, mosquito repellent, works great for that. And this week being National Pollinator Week, you can see that we have a little caterpillar growing on here. Yes, I mean the parsley, uh, the black swallowtail butterflies love the parsley and, and we leave them on here. Obviously, if, if pesticides have been used, you wouldn't want that worm on there, but we, we welcome them. Great. Okay. So if you've got any questions about using herbs, give us a call. Thank you for joining us. I'm Liz Snyder. And I'm Jim Hotelling, the home gardeners from Hillside Garden and Landscaping.